guys welcome back to another vlog welcome back to everything Shar. um if you are new please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and if you are returning you know as always you are greatly appreciated i know i'm like all over the place i'm out of breath i'm hot i look rough but i wanted to um go ahead and just start off this um bbl vlog you know um i've been kind of like touching on it like here and there but um we are less than three weeks out from me and my best friend q going to miami and getting our bbls done so i did want to hop on the camera and kind of like talk to you guys a little bit about like i guess um the before like um what i've had to do to like get prepared and things like that so um first of all let me prop you guys up um, first of all i'm going to miami um, 305 plastic surgery and the doctor that I'm going to is Dr. William um, I've been pretty much following him for like um, over a year and a half now um, I, <clears throat> but yeah the surgery itself is $7,500 um, we're staying in, re in a recovery home um, let's see the flight obviously you know all that stuff just flying because I live in Arizona so um flying to miami had to get the flight um we're staying in a hotel the first night and then from the second to the eighth we're staying in a recovery house the recovery house that we're staying in is called sassy queen miami um and i mean if you guys want to know like all that like the cost of that and stuff then you know i can get that information for you guys but um i just went to walmart and um i just had to purchase because they have this list of stuff that they wanted us to buy um so what i didn't get at walmart i'm gonna end up buying it on like amazon but um let's see i can just show you i was gonna go to the list but i just show y'all um so first is again i look rough y'all anyways it don't matter <laughs> um uh, fragrance free lotion so i decided to get this lubiderm um, I've actually never tried this brand. I'm more of like a div or, you know, I also like oils and like body creams and body butters. Um, but, um, fragrance free lotion. Um, gauze pads. I got the bigger ones. Gauze pads. Um, baby wipes. Uh, Tylenol PM. Um, my friend Q, you're supposed to get Tylenol PM. They say Tylenol PM and Tylenol Extra Strength. She has a big old bottle of Extra Strength, so I just got us the PM here. Um, little Papa. Um, I got this water bottle because I just wanted one. Um, this um, Arnica Gel, and I got this brand Arnicare Gel, but it's basically like muscle pain and stiffness swelling from injuries and bruises you know to help with that type of stuff so i had to get that um also some stool softener i got this one because it has a stimulant laxative and then um you had to get a female urinal this is like the only brand that they had at walmart i was gonna get it off amazon but i decided to get this one um let's see here Um, medical tape, um, feminine wipes, so I got two of those, um, antibacterial soap, I don't think that I needed all these, but they didn't have the smaller ones at Walmart, and at Walgreens, the small ones cost, like, more of my, so I just got this one, whatever, antibacterial soap. I couldn't find any antibacterial body wash. Um, I also got these laxatives too. Um, I got the other ones just because it says that they um, it stimulates. So I don't know. Got two kinds. Whatever. Um, 
yeah and also there's a couple things that i didn't get from there i'm gonna end up getting from amazon so i guess i have to pull out my list anyway um um, dry shampoo, not using that. Hello. Um, let's see what else. Compression socks. I'm gonna get my. Um, they had some at Walmart or Walgreens. Yeah, Walmart, but it was like one pair. When I can get like a three pack or a five pack off Amazon, so I'm gonna get the compression socks off Amazon. And I already have slip-on shoes. Um, I already have a robe. I might get another robe. But um, I do already have some robes. It um, says loose fitting dresses, which um, I'll probably hit up like Ross or something to be honest. And then, because I don't have a lot of like loose fitting dresses. Um, and then it says like tank tops to wear under our like garments, our foams, and our compression board. So I do need to get like some um, some tank tops. And yeah, I don't know why I tweaked because I definitely forgot pads. But I'll go, I'll go back and get them. So that's fine. Um. You guys shopping for Miami? There's a list of stuff that we needed um, to get for after surgery. So wanted to get what I could in store, and then the rest I'm gonna get off of Amazon. So boom. This is how you know I'm impatient, cause I dead ass order tape measure off of Amazon, but it don't get here tomorrow. And I want to measure myself today because I want to order my faja now. But, um, yeah, the doctor that me and my best friend are going to, he designed his own faja. So, um, in order to know what size faja to order, I got a tape measure. So, I'm going to have uh, my mom measure me so I can kind of gauge on what, what size faja to get. I think it's going to be like a medium or a small but yeah um yeah but again i kind of just wanted to hop on camera and um tell you guys a little bit about like i said the preparation and all that stuff um we leave june 1st our surgery is on june 3rd and we will be flying back home on june 8th so i mean i'm definitely going to be taking you guys with me obviously i'm going to try to vlog and record as much as i can yeah um um i will check in with you guys um a little bit later probably tomorrow for sure just because we do have to get our blood work done um and my appointment is tomorrow um the place that i'm getting my blood work done is um lab and they are actually coming to my house to do it so i actually think that's pretty dope um so yeah i'm gonna hop on camera tomorrow and um, probably film that for you guys you know yeah so uh, I'm excited you guys I'm nervous um, I mean this is has been a long time coming for sure and I'm ready to you know just get it over with but I'm gonna chill for the rest of the night um, yeah I'm kind of tired I worked and everything and then had to go do this whole little store run but yeah I'll see you guys later Okay, so before I actually do call it a night, um, I just had my mom measure me, my waist and my hips. So again, I know what size for how to get. Plus, it's I want to see like how my measurements are different. Like obviously pre-surgery and post-surgery. So my waist is a 32.5, and my hips are a 40. So um, after surgery, we'll see. But um. <laughs> Obviously, my hips are going to get bigger and my waist is going to get smaller. So, that's what I need to base, like, what size Faha I'm going to purchase off of that. Okay, so, um, like I said, 32.5 waist and 40 inch hips. So, um, obviously, like I said, my hips are going to get bigger and my waist is going to get smaller. So, um... 32.5 so that's a medium I think I kind of knew that 32 right now in the waist and then 42.6 to 45 inch hips um, I think I'm gonna have to get a medium and a small but yeah because my waist is definitely gonna shrink so um, 
medium and a small and then I'm gonna order a medium right now um, and then I'm definitely gonna have to get it like altered and then I might even have to purchase an actual small so yeah okay I'm gonna order my phone Hey you guys, welcome back. Um, today is Monday. Um, I didn't vlog at all this weekend, I don't think. Um, well, Saturday I think I dropped, jumped on because that's when I got my blood work and stuff done. But um, I just wanted to show you guys my Faha. My Faha has arrived. I did order the one that Dr. Williams um, designed himself. This is who I'm getting my surgery by, like I told you guys before, Dr. Williams. Um, I got a size medium um, just because my waist I came in at a 32.5 and then my hips I was a 40 so I kind of went um, a little bigger for my um, hips and then it has like four different clasps so I'm thinking I'm okay but I might actually have to order a small too which is fine because it says it, it says that you might you know need two different sizes anyway um, obviously I'm gonna probably get this one you know the medium altered um, you know, after like a week or whatever it says, but yeah, you guys, um, it has all this stuff like on the website too, as far as like their story, the size chart, um, the different features and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm excited. Um, I did get pads, so that is something else that it had on our list. Um, don't mind me being a big old bum today, but, um, I did order... Um, the compression socks. Um, I did order my compression socks off Amazon, so those should be here tomorrow. And the last thing that I need to get is like tank tops and stuff. I do have some in my Amazon cart, but I kind of want to just go to the store and see if I could find some. Um, but yeah, I think that's the last thing that I'll need to get is like tank tops to go underneath like, um, my compression boards and stuff like that. Um... Yeah, so, yeah, you guys, I'm almost down to two weeks, and then we're going to be taking off, so I'm going to do these little updates, obviously, and then when we go, um, that's when everything going to get really real. Um, Q has her blood work and stuff tomorrow, so yeah, oh my god, I can't believe it, we have like 18 days till we actually have our surgery, and then less than, and then like two weeks, less than two weeks, yeah two weeks until like we take off to Miami but again I just wanted to come in and check in on you guys I'm um, sure you guys the Faha um you guys will see it on eventually you know what I mean but yeah um bye y'all say a couple words oh yes Hello. this is Candace um eighth grade graduation 2022 period there goes mama yeah. right there you did a great job Kim thank you <laughs> say hey bro <laughs> yes, y'all. I want to see my school. Yeah, we gotta get pictures, but Candace Remy Connor. Good morning, you guys. Um, today is uh, May 20th, which is, it's Friday. Um, I just wanted to come on the camera and talk to you guys about um, surgery. You guys already know. Um, I'm going to get ready to edit this vlog and probably post it um, just so, you know, I can kind of keep it going. But um, the reason why I wanted to hop on here today is because we've had a couple of changes, y'all, and they all happened yesterday. So um, when me and my best friend, you know, we're going together, same doctor, same day. It was supposed to be June 3rd, Dr. Williams, 305 in Miami. Um, we woke up to a text message and email saying that our doctor could not do our surgery on June 3rd because he has hospital cases that he has to do that day. And they pretty much told us that he is available on the 1st of June, the 2nd. Um, let me see what days they had. 
Okay, it says Dr. William is available on June 1st, 2nd, 6th, 7th, 9th, or the 14th. So we were already going to fly out there the 1st through the 8th, so we decided to just push it one day before and do it on the 2nd. So with that being said, now that our surgery is on the 2nd of June, um, our pre-op is going to be on the 1st, and we were flying in on the 1st, so <laughs> we had to change our flight from the 1st to the 31st. Um, she had flight credit, so she didn't have to pay anything more. Um, I did not, so I did have to pay like 90 something dollars to make my uh, flight earlier. And then we had to um, contact the recovery house because our day is going to be changing there. Um, and yeah, um, yeah, so with also with the changing, uh, changing everything, we found out that Sassy Queen Miami, which is the recovery house that we're staying in. Um, is no longer Sassy Queen Miami. <laughs> okay, sorry you guys. I'm on the clock, obviously. But, um, yeah, so Sassy Queen Miami is not Sassy Queen Miami anymore. And then, um, I'm so glad that I have my best friend, like, kind of doing this with me. And I know she got upset talking to the lady. But, um, basically, I don't know. It's like a new company. Um, but we had already paid our deposits. And we were already, like told a certain price you know what I mean so we were expecting that and then once we had to like change everything because our surgery day got changed that's when we found out that it's now called charm charm home Miami and the prices are a little bit different um, my friend Q's kind of been handling like you know um, that type of thing so she talked to the lady um, I think she's gonna contact us back just to see if she could still honor our prices or not but I mean at the end of the day like I hope that she can, but if they can't, I mean, um, we're still going to have to just do what we have to do and go. We don't really want to put in the work to find a different recovery house, so it kind of just is what it is in that sense. Um, also, we have um, ordered our foams, our ab board, our backboards, um, and our BBL chair. We were going to get the package from the recovery home, and I want to say it was like 350 or so, but... We kind of, um, after, you know, having to switch things around and having to spend a little bit more money, we just decided to get, like, our own stuff. And it actually came out cheaper. So the boards we got from this company called um, Tributo. Yeah, uh, we also paid our deposits for, um, for I'm sorry, our massages. So we're, while we're in Miami, I'm thinking that we'll eat at least, need at least two massages. Maybe more, but um, we already put our deposit down for... Um, two massages, so um, I've already got mine scheduled, so our surgery's on the 2nd, and then I'm going to have a massage on the 3rd, and then on the 4th, and we've already paid our deposits for our massage massages when we get back to Phoenix, so we already found that we're going to get our massages through and all that good stuff. Having a buddy or a partner to do it with you is like, it makes it like so much better, y'all. So I'm so glad that we're taking this journey together and, you know, we were getting, everything's pretty much, you know, I feel taken care of unless there's some more last minute changes, which I pray that there are not. But yeah, everything seems to be coming together. So I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit more later um, or like I said, you know, this weekend when she comes over. But yeah. Okay, this is the back key. Feel so real estate department. You open it and it like comes out. Contact oh, name. So I got. Oh my gosh. Right here, Jason. Oh my gosh. And phone nice number as well. Um, HOA name, reunion citizens. Try it out, test it out. Got right here. How does it feel? Yeah. yeah. Can you imagine? <laughs> okay. Was kneeling on it. Show the people the pillow. Yay, you guys. And then that's cues, you know, or whatever. But yeah, both of our pillows are here, y'all. Ah! 
so excited. Yeah, 26. Um, so, you guys, I packed already. Oh, I got my hair done. My cousin Kim did my braids. She did my braids, y'all. Thank you, cousin. So that way I don't have to deal with my hair while I'm in Miami. And then I did pack, you guys. Let me just open the case and show y'all. But I went to, um, like, Walmart and I got, like, some tank tops and stuff so I could wear underneath, like, my Faha and my boards and phones and stuff <clears throat> then i had to get like some loose dresses um <clears throat> yeah so some loose dresses because i obviously didn't have any like you know dresses i don't really like to wear dresses like that because i never like the way they look but yeah just to wear over like my um my faja and stuff so i packed <clears throat> and i had like these packing cubes that i had got off amazon and they are pretty clutch, y'all. So, um, let me turn on this light really quick. Boom. So, I packed. That's, like, all my clothes, like, my T-shirts and dresses and tank tops and stuff like that. And then in here, I got, like, bras and socks and stuff like that. And then in this one, say hi, Papa. Say hi, Papa. And in this one, like, I have, like, all, you know, the feminine wipes, the... Um, you know, like all the stuff that they told us to bring on the list, the, um, the Arnicare gel and the, um, move pop up, like the bandages and, or the medical tape, I should say, and, you know, just all the stuff on the list, the feminine wipes, all that stuff's in there, so that fit in this suitcase, and then, um, we're also bringing a check bag. And that's going to have, like, um, our boards, our BBL pillows, um, like, the pads, like, all the big stuff in there. And, yeah. So, I think I'm pretty much, like, okay now. I picked up, um, like, stuff from the store that I needed. And, yeah. So. Um, and I think I'm going to bring, like, my, um big LV bag since I have like the biggest bag that I have and I'm going to bring like my um, iPad and my laptop and stuff like that so that's why I'm going to carry my big 
big bag. But yeah, other than that, guys, I think I'm all set. Yay! Um, a week from today is when we actually have our surgery, so next Thursday is the surgery. Um, yeah, I'm excited. I'm definitely excited. So. I just want to get it over with and like be back home and like be healing and you know getting my post-op massages and stuff like that like it's been kind of stressful so yeah I'm definitely ready to get it like over with you know what I mean like I just want everything to run smoothly and everything like that it's been kind of crazy like I'm, I mean I probably when we get past it I'll be able to like sit down and tell you guys more about it but like these last like couple weeks or so I've been kind of like stressful um just because like it's kind of like you know the deadline and we have to have everything submitted and turned in properly and stuff like that and it's just it's kind of like an up and down roller coaster but like i said once we get past all like the actual surgery um i'm probably gonna actually like you know go like more in depth as far as like what me and my best friend kind of had to deal with as far as like setting all this up and Working with our recovery house and working with 305 plastic surgery and obviously like if I, I don't know, I'm not going to say if I didn't know going in that it would be like this and I would have done it because this is something that I still really mu very much wanted to do, you know what I mean? And I do like the doctor and like his work, but as far as like dealing with 305, like absolutely not but like I said I'll get into that later I honestly just want to be positive want to be happy so that way like you know I have like a good surgery and stuff and just get to Miami peacefully you know check into our recovery house have them take us to our pre-op take our COVID test pass our COVID test and then go have our surgery you know what I mean so yeah um a lot of things definitely had to get switched around and changed like and somewhat at the last minute so Again, y'all, it has been kind of stressful, but we're pretty much at the end of the road right now, so I'm excited. Um, I think I have everything that we need. Um, so, yeah, you know, I don't want to forget anything. I really, really don't. So I just want to make sure that, you know, we're good to go. We have everything situated and stuff. So, yeah. Um, I'll check back in with you guys, obviously. Um, I actually think I'm going to end up finishing off this vlog and, you know, just starting a new one. Probably Sunday, I'm going to edit this footage and try to post it as soon as possible. Um, I do have Monday off, it's Memorial Day, and then we leave Tuesday. So it's like I want to start like a fresh video for when we actually take off and stuff so i'll probably like like i said record up until sunday edit it hurry up and post it so that way i can start you know doing the actual bbl vlog <laughs> this is so exciting and nerve-wracking at the same time i'm nervous but i'm definitely excited you guys so hey y'all <laughs> Uh, hey you guys, so today's Friday, woo woo, we made it, even though I work tomorrow, so whatever. But anyways, um, I ordered this, um, it's like a purse organizer, I've kind of been plotting this, this for a little while, a little while, um, I'm kind of like OCD, like, I think it's a good thing, but whatever. But yeah, it's like helping me organize my purse, because I wanted to bring this big bag with me to Miami. I don't want to get it messed up, but, like, you know, it'll be cool because I could, like, carry um, more stuff in this bigger bag. So, I got this little black organizer thing off of Amazon. Um, I, I want to say Aaliyah's face is the one who I saw it from, but it, I love it. It's so cute. It's definitely going to help me, like, keep everything organized and, like, make sure that I can fit everything. Um, but there goes my laptop, my iPad, my laptop charger, iPad charger. I'm going to put, like, my, you know, my passport and all that good stuff in here so I'm gonna prop you guys up a little bit I know that angle is kind of like there we go so yep yeah. um, I just wanted to make sure like I already put like my camera in there but obviously I'm recording right now so my camera fits in there and then um, I don't need to bring this but like 
my see into green. I don't need these or this. But like um my memory card and then there's a the thing so I can like edit my videos and stuff. Um my charger's right there, so I'm gonna put that in there and you know, have everything set up for like what I'll need to like edit and stuff. Cause I kinda wanna um edit while I'm out there, you know, and be laying on my tummy, so uh yeah, this'll work. This will be cool. And like everything is better organized and it kind of gives it a little bit more form too, which I like. So definitely a 10 out of 10. Like I said, um, I'll make sure I put a picture up if I haven't done that already. But yeah, I love this. I love this. Definitely a good buy. And like, like I said, it makes sure everything fits and it's organized. And it has like this thing that kind of like you can put in the middle. It's just more, it's like a lot of storage. So I love that for me. I love that for me. But yeah, you guys, uh, like after tomorrow, um, after tomorrow, I'm not working anymore until like after I come back from Miami and everything. So I'm excited. Um, it's going to be a long, a good weekend and then we leave on Tuesday. So I'm super fucking excited. You guys, it's like, I don't know what to do with myself. But, um, am I zoomed in? No? Okay. But yeah, I'm super excited. Like my best friend Q, she's super excited too. Like, uh, I can't wait to get past it because I really want to like kind of go in depth on what the fuck we had to go through because it's just too much honey but yeah you guys um down to the wire that's for sure so I'm just making sure I know I'm kind of packing like you know early but I really don't want to forget anything you know a lot of the stuff we actually need like you know this is not like a vacation vacation. We're going there to like get shit done and bring our asses back home, you know? So that way we can heal and whatever, whatever. But um, yeah, you guys, um, I think for the most part I have everything. I need to make sure my laptop, my iPad are like charged, that's for sure. So but like I said, I've, I have days. I'm just trying, I'm just like packing early to make sure like I'm not forgetting anything, missing anything. I still have to take the, um, gel polish off my nails and my toes actually so yeah that has to get done but yeah you guys um just jamming in my room listening to music nothing major so i just wanted to show you guys the thing that i got for my purse but bye y'all hey you guys um today is monday memorial day um, which means tomorrow uh, we leave for Miami, me and my boo queue. Um, so today just really chilling. Um, had to soak my acrylic or my gel um, off, I should say. So I kind of just got done doing that and I took a shower and stuff. And I'm just washing some clothes and making sure everything that I need is packed. And um, yeah, you guys, I'm excited. Uh, I can't believe in a few days, like, it's finally going to be done, you know what I mean? Like, then, yeah, so then we could, like, start the healing process and all that stuff. But, yeah, I just wanted to come on camera right now to kind of finish off this vlog because, like I said, um, I want to try to um, at least get done with this vlog so I can edit it because I do want to start, you know, once we go to the airport and get on the flight, da, 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 that's going to be a whole new vlog. So, yeah, um, stay tuned for that, you guys. Um, our BBL journey. <laughs> All right, I'll catch y'all in the next vlog.